And this is a necklace that I thought for sure should be in the book. It's very pretty. Sorry about that. My husband is cleaning the grill. He's going to have steak, so I hear him down there cleaning off the grill. But isn't that pretty? It's really nice. And we have this bracelet. So these items that I'm picking out of the box have not been able to find in the book. Pearl earrings. Very pretty. Red beaded plastic necklace, but I just think it's it's nice with the gold spacers and uh, nice quality. It's, it's also got a a patent number on it, I believe. Very cute. I like the red jewelry and the blue jewelry. And here's a really nice gold tone, long necklace. I made a repair with my pen on this because um, the clasp on one side was pretty pretty marked up so or discolored I think so I think I used my pen on it but it looks good looks good now. I think it was this side here because you see it's matte. This side here is polished, so I believe it was over here. But it looks good now, I think. Looks good enough to sell, I believe. And I do sell it. Um, I like it. It's in better. It's in really good shape otherwise. Very classic piece. So I have that. Kind of a bicycle type chain uh, bracelet with rivets, riveted construction like. Is that one signed? It's also got a patent number on it. Very pretty pearl bracelet. Faux pearl. have a stick pin. It's a shell. It's signed um, three places. Here on the bar. Where's it? Oh, it's signed twice. It's on the pin bar too, so it's signed on the bar somewhere. So that's good. Pretty faux pearls. The Napier script signature. Really nice condition. I think I got these from April at one time. Uh, I've had these a good while. I like these. I got these in some kind of a lot that I bought. Still has the tag on it. $20. Well, actually, then it said two for 20, um, 16 inch, but, you know, the original tag was 20, and quality, quality piece of costume jewelry, cute design. Black earrings, some hoops, sculptured. They're signed in there, Napier. Got some fun yellow ones. This is also my own from probably the 80s. 
90s maybe. No, I think it's from the 80s. Um, black and gold chain. I remember going to a um, department store and buying. I, I used to have fun just going and buying some jewelry on sale. I always went to the sale racks and saw what they had. These are pretty. I like these. Little knot door knocker style. Smaller. Textured knots. Just got those recently from somebody. I don't know if they were friend mail maybe. I'm not sure. They might have been. Textured. Polished. Uh, I don't know where the other one is of is this one, but got a pair of those. But I only see one right now. There's some leaf clip ons. Necklaces, you see a good many of these. I think Monet has a version of these. Napier has a version. These flat curb lengths. This one just looks like it's double, but it's not. I think Monet's is actually the double, double strand. This one just looks like it is. And here's the other earring. There's the other earring like that. And I have these cute little white cubes or squares. White enamel from the 90s probably, 80s, 90s. Cute. Have these tiny, oh, come out of there. Stuck in there. These are in really nice shape. Small little pearl flower earrings, dainty. I like these a lot. Tempted to sell them. I really like them for my collection though, but um, I know they'd probably sell well. So, I don't know. I'm gonna sell all of this stuff at some point in time. I hope. <laughs> I hope to. This was my own. I had this a long time, probably from the 80s. Just a simple ball chain, or a beaded, silver beaded chain. Just plain, probably 20 inches. And I just got these recently. And they're newer, silver tone. Sure, they're pretty new. The metal doesn't feel good like, you know, like the, the older style earrings. You know, nothing is made, made good anymore. You can even look at that and see the quality is just not there. Um, not like it used to be, that's for sure. It's not even, you know, it doesn't even feel like real metal. So you can just always tell the vintage between the vintage and the newer stuff. Um, here's a cute necklace. Older. And here's some nice bracelets. That one's very nice. It reminds me of Brighton with all the ornate swirls and things. I like that one. I would wear that, and I would wear it with this because it looks similar, and this is a really nice one too. So I would wear those 
those together probably. That would make a nice, a nice pairing, wouldn't it? Those. This is very nice also. I love the design of this. And it is an older piece too. Gold tone, probably, it's probably 20 inches too also. Very pretty. There certainly are enough of these chain type clips. These are chunkier. Now these might be in the book. I'll have to look. Seems like there was something like this in the book. I'll have to look again. Those, these I have two pair of. So you probably saw those before. Got, got way more uh, gold tone than silver tone, especially of this Napier stuff. Um, got these shrimp, shrimp style earrings. They're newer to, you can tell by the metal, quality. And these are vintage, nicer made with the chain, the rope chain. The box is getting empty. <laughs> these are some pearls, faux pearls, newer. Beer. Script signature. And here's a little chain. It's matte silver tone. Very dainty. So that's really different. One more bracelet with pearls and kind of wrapped, wrapped pearls, wire wrapped pearls. Very big pearl statement earrings from the 80s. Nice ones. Nowhere. Very nice. And I saw this on an auction recently. I think it was a uh, Barbie's, Barbie's auction, I believe. Uh, this Napier necklace, silver tone. It's pretty, I like it. Newer, but not real new. Um, I'm guessing early 90s, not sure. Early 90s, late 80s. But it's nice, it's a nice modern style piece. Lobster claw clasp. Okay. I don't have very many pins, but this is one of the pins I have. Swirly, swirly pin. And another bracelet. I have a good many bracelets. Oh, what's the matter, oh, Joey? That's... Joey smells the steak. Everybody's smelling that steak. It does smell good, but I don't really eat steak. Uh, this is another cute red and gold. Be cute for Christmas, wouldn't it? Red and gold Napier rope chain. Very nice condition. And I have one earring, one like hoop style earring, but I don't have another one. So anybody has one earring like this they want to send me <laughs> to make my pair? That'd be great. One more lonely little bracelet. And that is it. The box is empty except for a key for this little box and I am looking for more of these boxes but the bigger size 
the cardboard kind. Um, doesn't have to have a key or anything, but I'd like a, a big vintage box like that. I need another one. So, that is all we have for today. What are you looking at, Desiree? Hmm? You smell that steak? Yeah. So it's a beautiful day. And I guess I'll close out this video. I'm very happy to be back out on my porch and to just be out here with nature and the warm air and uh, and all the greenery coming out. So y'all have a blessed day and I will see you on the next video. Bye for now. Be kind when you're picking and uh, hit the uh, subscribe and uh, hit the bell if you want to see if you want to know when my uh, videos will be coming on, hit the bell so you'll be notified. Okay, bye-bye.